Hey guys, Victor here with Light Speed Construction. Uh, checking out this roof for a customer. Um, the original call was for a leak in his bathroom. Uh, right here, got the pipe loop. Uh, as you can see, it's been repaired uh, probably many times. Uh, lots of caulking all over, um, down the sides, tons of it, uh, right up top. Um, it does have a line of caulk at the bottom. Uh, currently, it's not doing anything, but uh, you really never want to have a line of caulk at the bottom because in case water gets in on the sides, you want to be able to have the water uh, come out. You don't want to have it trapped behind, which will definitely cause you leaks. This area right here, uh, it is a little soft, uh, most likely from that leak as well, uh, from the pipe boot. Uh, as you can see here, uh, pipe boots sticking out, nails coming out, so water could easily be getting in underneath there. Um, over here, I'm not sure if you can see it on the video great, but this back side of the roof has a lot of granules gone. Uh, not really sure the age of the roof. I believe the homeowner said the roof, they've been lived here about six years, so probably the roof is probably close to 15 years old, roughly. Um, you can see here, a little bit of loss, so show that there. Um, over here on this chimney, uh, I believe he said he didn't used to have a cricket. He had a handyman built cricket. Um, wood feels fine, but um, upon inspection, when you look under the shingles here, there's no step flashing, uh, no step flashing at all. Um, so that's definitely not good. On this counter flashing, you can see nails are popping out or they just really weren't hammered in to begin with uh kind of caulking all over um and some areas aren't sealed uh so water could be getting in there um and then big thing here on this ridge right here they actually just use dimensional shingles cut them up and use those for uh for ridge shingles uh typically don't want to be doing that um when you're doing that uh, with these dimensional shingles uh these tabs could create leaks so that's not recommended at all um this chimney right here at uh, the top um, fairly good condition uh, we could do an aldo coating on it just to protect it from some of these cracks and see crack there um possibly around the edges as well like that um and then front side of the roof uh kind of the same thing there is uh, some granule loss on the shingles on that flatter portion he did mention that um, he has had some leaks so um, if we do the roof, it is recommended to put some ice and water shield underneath and then the rest of the roof will get the synthetic underlayment. Right, thanks guys.